Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we are going to implement the addressing system. So, first of all, I will just save the whole scene. So, let's go to file, save scene, and we'll just go to save scene. And here, I will just name it time trial. So, we will just definitely create certain uh, uh, different types of dressing so that's why i'm just naming this uh, named this uh, scene as a time trial scene and uh, in this scene we will just go to save script and we will actually create a uh, variable here public static int player position so this is very important in the save script so after that we will just go to progress waypoint script which is actually related to waypoints and inside this script we will just create a variable public int position equal to zero and uh, then we will just move uh, uh, and we will just actually make this position inside this on trigger enter function we will just get the uh, position plus plus so we want to uh, uh, with every uh, waypoint, uh, the position of uh, one position will be added to the last position, and uh, then we are making save script dot player position equal to position which we have added here. So we are getting this save script player position, and we can implement. We are implementing this position over here. So that's great, and uh, now we will just move back to our uh, UI script. And inside UI script, we want to add some variables. So we will here uh, we will just create a variable, uh, a public text uh, total car text, and we will add a public text player position. Okay. So these two texts we have added, and uh, also we have added one more uh, one more object here, which is public int total cars. And uh, initially we have added uh, position uh, uh, total cars added one. Okay, you can definitely define your own cars in a time trial case. Uh, definitely we have only one car and uh, when we will add racing ai cars then we will definitely have uh, more cars so you can add three four five six seven up to so on and then in the start function we will just uh, add this line of code here so let's say a total cars text or text and we will add slash before total cars to string and then we are making player position dot text equal to one initially. So initially we will uh, populate one uh, for the player's cars position. And then in the update function here in the update function in the bottom you can uh, uh, here in the bottom uh, after these functions we can add this line of code where we can make a place position dot text equal to save script dot player position to string so that's it for the basic uh, positioning system definitely after adding ai cars we will move further and we will add uh, some more details with racing points but before that mm -hmm. i will just uh, select the canvas and uh, on the ui script we have these two more objects total car text and player position so we'll just uh, add uh, values and uh, here we will have value of total cars let's add this to total cars and then we have this position text for the position of the car and uh, now if you play the game you will see that uh, we will have only one car uh, which will be the opponent car and uh, our position will be one when we will start the lap so let's see when we will re uh, cross the waypoint you can see now the position is calculated and uh, we are on the first position okay so that's great that's uh, 
actually the basic implementation so we will just add uh, AI cars and we will uh, make some further implementation for the uh, uh, for positioning system